Ready. Welcome to the Ashley After Show. Happy Friday. I'm joined by Theo Vaughn. You may have seen him on Road Rules. You may have seen him on the Road Rules Real World Challenges. You may have seen him on TV. On Comedy Central. On Comedy Central. You may have seen him on the internet. On Yahoo. <laughs> yeah, okay? on safe parts of the internet. Okay. He is now a comedian, and you can see him tonight and tomorrow night at the La Jolla Comedy Store. Right? That's it? Is that good? Yeah. Okay, are you impressed yet? No. Damn it. I'm really trying to impress Theo Vaughn. You are? Well, yeah. say something else then. Okay, well. Tell me about yourself a little. Well, I wanted to ask you how tall you were, because I, I realized, well, I, you know, I feel like we have a connection. I obviously. feel like we I feel may. like I'm falling in love. And, oh, well, I feel like I'm falling in love, and I wanted to know how tall you were, because I feel like I tower over you in these stilettos. Okay, uh, you can call them stilettos if you want. I call them uh, working heels. <laughs> um, I am a healthy 6'1". Oh, nice. Recently been tested, totally chill on the up and up. Oh, well done. Thank High you. five on that. That is important. Okay, um, now I, there's a lot of things I want to talk to you about, but this can really be whatever you want to talk about. But like your cranktext.com, cranktexts. Dot com Correct. is genius. I was just perusing it, and it is seriously one of the funniest things I've ever seen. It's pretty messy. I mean, it gets pretty dark. It like, gets pretty fun. It's really ridiculous. Like, I can't believe that he prank texts people, and then, I mean, you'll go on Human and on, people. And you go on, I mean, sometimes these last months. Yeah, I mean, I've been in conversations that lasted probably nine months. And people never figure it out. No, because I think there's a people are a lo there's definitely people out there that are just lonely mm. and starve for attention, just like me, who's texting these people, probably. Mm -hmm. So you know, two people suffering from the same problem, and then we meet in the virtual reality, connected by our numbers, and then there we are, just in a little weird situation. Have you ever sh like actually sent them a picture of really you in any capacity? No, usually if they want a photo, I'll like pull random Google images off the internet. I'll just if they, you know, if they think I'm like, you know, an older gal, or if they think I'm a, you know, a, somebody who likes to go swim, and then I'll just be like, me at the swimming pool. I'll Google that and look at all the images, and I'll find Stop. one that seems kind of like the right, and then I'll just send them that. Has anyone ever caught on to the fact that you're crank texting them? Um, I mean, people have caught on that. Oh, somebody's messing with me after a while, um, and some people catch on right out of the gate. I mean, you usually have to crank. You usually have to text probably two two hundred numbers to get a really good conversation. So, I mean, oh it's really gosh. just it's an issue and it's a problem that I have. Is it kind <laughs> of an addiction? Is it kind of an addiction? It is. It's my strange addiction. Is I'm it be, your strange have you seen addiction? that show? Yes, where you have addictions to weird things. Yeah, some girl was drinking blood the other day, and then another fella was Stop. making out with sofa cushions. Oh, no. I mean, dang, what's your strange addiction? Shoes. I have a lot of shoes, but that's not really? a strange addiction. Yeah, like a lot of shoes, like an unhealthy amount of shoes. I have a friend who doesn't have any legs, and his strange addiction is feet. Oh, Isn't that that's weird? bizarre. That is strange. That is really strange. It's pretty weird, but that almost, it almost makes sense a little. Right, because he just he wants feet, so yeah. he wants feet. Well, maybe he'll get them next time. Yeah, maybe. Well, fingers, fingers crossed, because he still has his fingers. Yeah. I should probably. Okay. Yeah. This is now. I'm getting uncomfortable. Are you? Sorry? I always get uncomfortable in my interviews, though. This is normal. Do you? Yeah, I do. Especially if I'm, you know, totally vibing with someone like you and I are vibing. With are we? Right now. Well, obviously. Why okay, are you sorry. asking if we are? Because I thought that you and I were like totally on the same page with this. Look, I look, I'm in, man. I'll take you out for a nice, you know, some uh, hot cakes or something. Oh, some hot, hot cakes. Cake. Is that pancakes and yeah, Louisiana? make them hot. Boy, I heat them up though. Oh, what's up? I like that heat coming off them. Yeah. Now, do you live in LA now? Yep. Very different from Louisiana. It is. It's uh, I mean, it's just. I'm trying to think what the differences are. It's just more disconnected there because Louisiana is more of like a you know a place where you spend time with people more often. So. Really, is Louisiana small? Uh, I mean it's one of the big fifty, so it's a real state, but I guess it's kind of smaller. Yeah. Where are you from here? I'm from Northern California. Oh yeah, a bunch of dope smokers up there. Huh? What? Sorry. Oh my gosh. Well, a lot of people were conceived. I'd be offended if that wasn't true. Drugs. So mm -hmm. I'm not saying you. Do drugs. you do drugs? I am not a drug user. I'm uh, healthy and clean. Do you drink alcohol? I've been known to booze. Oh, okay. I cool. could be under the influence of alcohol right now. This could be alcohol. That's true, but it's not. I smell coffee. Yeah, it could be a hot gin coffee. I'm oh, happy. that's true. Mm -hmm. that's you know, you can hot gin and coffee. A lot of people don't realize that. It I hides didn't really. Well. Really? So I had no you're, clue. Yep. You're going to be a functioning alcoholic and you need to go to work or right. get your kids to school. Yeah. Coffee, 
gin. Put a little gin in. Mm. We're learning so much today with Theo Vaughn. The more you know. From Road Rules and Road 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 Rules Challenge. Mm -hmm. For me, the La Jolla Comedy Store tonight and tomorrow night. 8 o'clock and 10.30. you got to mm -hmm. go see him. I actually really do want to go see you. I think you should. I'll, you know what? I'll save you a seat. Really? Yeah. I'm a lap. Oh, that's exactly where I want to sit. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, Theo. Well, look, enough of this foreplay. I don't know, that's what I'm saying. Turn the effing camera off. Yeah, or turn know. it on, huh? Oh, that's what like I'm saying, house. Theo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is so weird. I love it. Um, okay, cool. Well, thank you for coming on. I really, I feel like I could talk to you forever. Can I ask you one last question? What's your yeah. favorite part about your job? Because you do so many things, and I, I kind of am a little bit jealous because everything that you do are other things that I would love to do. Like yeah. that daily internet TV show where you talk about reality shows. Mm -hmm. That is amazing. That's all I watch is reality shows. Oh, well, we have a lot in common there, then. Oh, I my gosh, what, I would love that gig. Favorite part about my day? I don't know, actually. Talking I guess. Talking to me, it's fine. Yeah. Talking to you and oh, thinking of new jokes, I guess, is, is always a fun thing because, mm -hmm. you know, you never know what your brain will create. Where do you get most of your material from, watching reality TV? Yeah, I mean, probably from being, uh, yeah, from watching tell. I mean, watching TV, you know, I mean, thinking about things that men think about. So, just being a man, probably, and thinking about that. Thinking about women. Something. Thinking about girls, thinking about, you know, work, getting older and still dealing with, you know, like, just life. I mean, just life, I guess. I mean, life's pretty messed up, so there's some humor in there. Yeah. Well, cool, Theo. So, are you wearing shampoo? No, I'm wearing Gucci Flora. Oh, whoa, a showboater, huh? <laughs> I was just hoping you had a little bit of Garnier Fructus in there. Right? <laughs> I get up in that. <laughs> Thank you for coming on. <laughs> He's the best. Have a great weekend. Go see him tonight, tomorrow night.